Good evening. I hope okay. I, I will call you the all um the day. Okay. <laughs> the, Thanks. Uh, the other the other classmate. Uh, uh -huh. uh, the other classmate. Uh, first day, the first day is seven. Yes. Seven. I. Bessie, no. Bessie. Bessie. Yes. Bessie. <laughs> I, I Good will. evening, teacher. Your your microphone is. It's off. You are mute. The teacher, the teacher, you are mute. Hello, how <laughs> are you? Hello. What are we you are talking about? We are uh, about the birthdays on September. About them? <laughs> we. We. Birthdays. 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 Ah, September birthdays. birthdays. Yeah, my my birthday and uh, and Alicia Alicia birthday it's the next week. When when is your birthday, birthday. Madeline? Se el 10, September 10. September and Alicia, 10. 11. 11. Ah, one after <laughs> the other. Other, yeah. other classmate. Yeah. Bessie. Bessie is the seven. Seven. The seven, Monday. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Monday. Why, when yes. is your birthday? My birthday is in October. Ah, October. Next month. Oh. Next the next month. month. So we still next have time. Month. I wish you all the fun. best because uh, we don't know in the in the, the next month you are you will be the teacher. I don't know. I don't know. So you can send me the presents. Uh, <laughs> hey, in the okay. Next, in the uh, day, okay. Gift. Because we don't know. <laughs> give me gift, many gifts. Many gifts. Okay. I hope so. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. Very good. So, how was your day today? Oh, great. A busy day. Busy, busy. Busy day. day. Working oh. right now. Well, working in the morning. Working in the yes. morning. Me too. Okay. Very good. Now, uh, Alicia, you have to do your final test. Okay? Okay. That's what is pending on you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Very good. Let, let me see who is next right here. Okay, let me see. Osman, you still have to complete homework four and the final test. Okay. Remember that before okay. tomorrow noon. Okay. Okay. Uh, Annie okay. Nunez is complete. Okay. Uh, Thank you. Hello, Veronica. How are you? I'm fine, teacher. Veronica, you have 40% of the homework four. So you have to yeah. complete homework four in the final test, okay? Okay. Now, very good. Uh -huh. uh, let me see. Madeline. Madeline, you need, you have, you haven't done the homework four and the final test too before. Uh -huh. Okay, remember that they are asking uh, the coordinator, academic coordinator, send you a message that uh, she needs the grades before noon. Okay, mm -hmm. so before 12 o'clock. Okay, tomorrow. Okay, so Ninive is not here yet. Okay, let's see. Uh, Bessie, Bessie, you need to do homework four and the final test okay so please try to okay do that. Where, where teacher uh -huh. a question what is the final test the final what test is? Is, is right what here is in a, plat a, a platform platform yeah, yes platform. yes it's in the platform ah, I it's in the at platform ten, at 10 o'clock tomorrow i will send you ah? <laughs> i will no, before, send you tomorrow at, 12 at, 10, at 10 o'clock 12 o'clock please <laughs> Okay. No, it's not at twelve. No, before I say before twelve o'clock. I I gave, I gave no I I I told you uh -huh. at ten o'clock. Ah, ten o'clock. 
Okay, I cannot that is go perfect. tomorrow. Okay, so can you see right here? Can you see the, the screen? Yes. 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 Okay, so you need the final exam is right there. Mm -hmm. Look, did you see it? Yes. Yes. Final exam. And remember that you have to do, okay, it has four parts. So you're going to do part number one, part number two, part number three, and part number four. And uh, the, all the tasks, task 4.1, 4.3, 4.5, 4.6, 4.7, 4.8, 4.9, 4.10, 4.11, 4.12, 4.13, 4.14, 4.15, 4.16, 4.17, 4.18, 4.19, 4.20, 4.21, 4.22, 4.23, 4.24, 4.25, 4.26, 4.27, 4.28, 4.29, 4.30, 4.31, 4.32, 4.33, 4.34, 4.35, 4.36, 4.37, 4.38, 4.39, 4.40, 4.41, 4.42, 4.43, 4.44, 4.45, 4.46, 4.47, 4.48, 4.49. Okay, this is the task for today, okay, which is uh, the last task, okay? So some, some of you have already done the, the, the homeworks, okay? So please complete it, okay? So this is homework number nine, you see? Very easy, it's about present perfect, passive voice. So very easy, five questions, 4.9. So if you haven't done it. Okay, any more questions? No. Are you sure? Hey, about the final yes. ex exam, final exam, how many, uh, how many parts complete? All, part okay. one, part two, part three, part four. Oh, yes. You have to complete the four parts of the final test. Okay? Okay. I think there are five questions for each part. Nine parts. Five. Five questions for each part. Five questions. Okay? Okay. So please, do that. Uh, let me see. Now that that is clear. Okay. Now let me see who else is here. Beatriz. You need to do the homework for Beatriz and the final test. Yes, teacher. Nineveh, Nineveh is not here yet, okay? Uh, Bessie, homework four and the final. Yes. Alvaro, Alvaro is not here yet, okay? Uh, Blanca Estela, let me see. I am here, teacher. Okay, hello, Blanca Estela, I know. Blanca Stella, you need to do, you already did. You already did that. Maria Adelina, homework four and the final test. Maria Eugenia, uh, hi, teacher. the final test. You need to do the final test. Marta Beatriz, the final test. Nineveh, homework four and the final test. Rafael, the final test. Raul, the final test. Vanessa, homework four and the final test. Veronica, complete homework four and the final test. And Osman, complete homework four and the final test. Okay? So, so we will be okay. Okay? Very good. Okay, now let me check attendance real quick. Jader Edemer is absent today. Okay, let's see. Blanca Estela Perez de Vasquez. Present teacher. Thank you. Maria Eugenia Cruz de Magaña. Present teacher. Thank you. Bessie Anayensi Joguel Valiente. Present. Okay. Oscar Eduardo Majano Guevara. Not present yet. Okay. Eh, Raúl Mauricio Rivera Saldívar. Present. Okay, thank you. Nínive Saraí Hernández. Nínive. Uh -huh. Where is Nínive? Not present today. Okay, next is uh, Marta Beatriz Alegría Barahona. Present. Thank you. Uh, Álvaro Enríquez Rivas Ángel. Álvaro. Álvaro is not here yet. Okay. Okay. Uh, Rafael René Molina. Present, sir. Okay, thank you. María Adelina Araya Menéndez. Present, teacher. Thank you. Alicia Carolina López Núñez. Present, teacher. Thank you. Okay, very good. Uh, 
Osman Enrique Hernández. Present teacher. Ok. Alicia Carolina López Núñez. Present teacher. Thank you. Ok. Cecilia. Daniel Osvaldo Pérez Aguilar. Present. Thank you. Eh, Verónica Beatriz Mendoza. Verónica Beatriz Mendoza. Present, teacher. Thank you. Ok. Ana del Carmen Cortés de Núñez. Present, teacher. Thank you. Andrea Alexandra Flores Chacón. Present, teacher. Thank you. Eh, Kenia Johanna Pérez. Y Vanessa Alexandra Armas. No here yet. Hello, Ninive. Ah, Ninive is here. Hello. I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay, no problem. Ninive and okay. who else? Aninunya, Ninive. Okay. So, very good. So, what are we going to do today? Very simple. Okay, we are going to start with this. Okay, as usual. Okay, so we are going to to have video conference number 25, okay? The last one. And the objective is to review unit number four. Can you see, can you see the screen? Hello? Yes. yes. Okay, yes. and what are we going yes. to do? We are going to, to review unit four vocabulary. Review the passive voice with the present perfect. Review assessing risk and review safety procedures. Okay. Now, we are going to go to the book. Okay. So I have the book right here. Where I have the book? Ah, the book is right here. Can you see it? Can you see the book? Yes. Yes. Okay. Very yes, good. Teacher. Okay, so we're going to start with vocabulary. Okay, so we're going to start with vocabulary on page, page 30, page 34. Okay, now do you remember what is a risk? Can you tell me what is a risk? Risk. Riesgos. Yeah, Riesgos. but the definition, the definition. Potential to be dangerous and to cause harm. Exactly. Potential to be dangerous and to cause harm. Now, what is a hazard? Hazard is the third, uh, like, like, like who? Likelihood of harm in a specific circumstances. Uh -huh. Likelihood of harm in a specific circumstances. What is exposure? Exposure is... Unprotected from something dangerous or unpleasant. Very good. Unprotected from something dangerous or unpleasant. So that means you are exposed to danger. You are exposed to risks and hazards. Okay, what is safety measure? Procedure to prevent something dangerous from happening. Okay, it's a procedure to prevent something dangerous from happening. What is irreversible damage? Consequences Consequence. or damage. Continue. That is so serious. That is impossible to undo exactly that is a consequence or damage that is so serious that is impossible to do and precautionary i meant to protect someone something from a hazardous situation uh -huh. aimed Aimed, aimed to protect, uh -huh. aimed. Aimed to, aimed to protect someone or something aimed. from hazardous, hazardous, hazardous situation. Okay, very good. And then 
we have, as you know very good now, now you know very good, we have, <laughs> we have office hazards, mm -hmm. we okay. have electricity and fire hazards, hazards. we have hazardous, hazardous substances, substances, and we have slips, trips, and falls risks. Fall All of them are hazards and risks. Okay? Yes. Any questions? No. Ah, by the way, by the way, remember that to, today at nine o'clock, after we check the list at nine o'clock, we are going to stop. And the ones, the ones that haven't done the survey, we are going to do the survey, finish the survey, send <laughs> the picture to the to the WhatsApp and then continue the class. Is that clear? No, 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 no. Okay, the ones that haven't done the survey, you understand what is the survey? Survey, no. Survey, no. la encuesta. Okay, about no. the teacher, about English corporativo services. I sent, okay. I sent it. So if you already send it, okay, no problem. You are not going to do it again because you only. You are supposed to send it only once, but there are some of you that haven't sent it. So we are going to do, I'm going to guide you to fill up the correct information and complete the survey and take a, a, a screenshot of the survey and send it to the group. No, send it to Elena's uh, 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 WhatsApp. Okay? Okay, let's continue. That's gonna be at nine o'clock. Okay, here, uh, we have verbs. You know what is the meaning of issue? Issue is bienes, issue. Aha, uh -huh. do you remember what is the meaning of issue? Problem. Remember? It's a problem. Is a topic, right? It's a topic. Aha, it's, uh -huh. it's okay. a topic, it could be a problem. It could be a problem, okay? So here we have, what is an issue? Okay? Okay, so that is a problem. That is also a... Uh, and a topic, okay? Very good. So now number two. Innovate, you know what is innovate, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. to, something new. Uh -huh. To make something, uh -huh. to think and do something new. You know what is to make? Innovate. Do you know what is to train? Innovate. To create? To train. And to, to give. Train, no teacher. Train. To train. Okay, for example, you are being trained in English. You are receiving English training. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yes. We call that in Spanish capacitar. Yes. And training is capacitación. Okay. Okay. Very good. Yes. Thank you. More vocabulary, real quick. Real quick. We're going to check the vocabulary, which is next. Okay. Do you know what is contamination or pollution? Yes. What is it? Waste contamination is contamination. Gas, gas, or they residues hazard, that are hazard. handled in properties. Contamination was the result that are handled improperly, skated uh -huh. to other areas, and causes the areas to be closed down. That is correct. Waste residues that are handled improperly. Scatter to other areas and cause the areas to be closed down. So that is contamination. What are casualties? Employee dies in the action. Employee. Uh -huh. Employees die in an accident operating Open a machine. machine. Okay, very good. Property damage. Machine, Machine of the down. 
Uh -huh. Machines often break down, break so that down. is a property damage. Loss of customers. Customer switch to another provide this provider. 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 This this business. Or business. That is correct. So customers switch to another provider or business. That is totally correct. Okay, now what is financial loss? The productions. Financial. What is the financial the company, loss? The company, company loses, loses money. money. Uh -huh. The money. company loses. Lose. The company loses money. Loses money. Yeah, loses. the company loses money. Okay, very good, very good. The next one, what is a business interruption? The production stops. The production stops or sales stops if you are only doing sales. Okay, so financial loss, loss of trust in the organization, loss of customers, business interruption, property damage. Property damage and casualties. Very good, very good. Casualties. And that is it, okay? Now, I want you to go to this page. Casualties. Okay, and I want you to, first, I want you to put that link. Click on that link, please, on the first link. Can you see that link? Passive boys, quiz number one, passive boys in the present perfect. So I yes. want you to click on that link, please. Click on that can link. You, can you paste in the in the chat, please? Yeah, I can Picture. paste it in the chat, no problem. Okay? Thank please. You. Thank you. Okay, no problem. So I'm going to paste it in the chat. Okay, there you go. So here it is. And you have it right there. And I'm going to paste the second Thank you. One. I'm going to paste the second one, too. Okay. Okay, so you can have both. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to paste the second one now. And there you have it. Both of them. Yeah. So go ahead and paste them on your Google bar. Okay? And you let me know when you have it ready. Yeah, I have it the first. I have the first. Yeah, the first I have one. The second. No, no, the first one. Uh, Veronica, okay. first the first one. <laughs> first the first one. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, so place the first one first. <laughs> okay, and you're supposed to have this. Okay. On the first one, you're supposed to have this. I think this, yeah, this is the first one. Okay? So, let's try to do this. Okay, now let's go with the first one. So you see, they gave you, they give you a lot of choices. They have not contracted missiles. Okay? So rewrite the sentence in the present person passive form. So what is the correct passive form sentence? What is the correct no. passive boy sentence? The, the, the missiles have not been contracted by them. Aha, uh -huh, correct. Missiles have not missiles have not been contracted by them. <laughs> and this the, is the scream is dark, teacher. Huh? The scream is dark. And now? No. Mm. Yes, yes. Oh, yes. Now, yes. Now, yes. Okay, so missiles. Missiles. Are what is missiles? Missiles. What is missiles? Sarampion. Missiles. Campion. Okay. Oh, sarampion. Ah, sarampion. Sarampion. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Be careful. Be careful. Okay. <laughs> I say missiles, <laughs> missiles. <laughs> thank you, thank you, teacher. <laughs> I know. Okay. 
Okay, missiles. Okay, can you see it? Yes. Yes. And the translator. <laughs> okay, so here, missiles. Can you see it? Missiles. Okay, now let's go to the next one. Missiles. What is number two? Correct. Remember, in negative, in negative sentence, not is placed between has or have and been. So, very good. Now, this is a question. What should be correct? Um. Have, have, have the documents been sum, submitted already? Have been submitted. The uh, last? Submitted. 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 That is correct. So, have, because it's a question the last. to start with yes. have. So, have the documents been submitted already? So, that is correct. Okay? Very good. Now, you are going to okay. do the rest in groups. Are you ready? Okay. Yes. yes. Okay. okay, let me break you into groups right now, okay? So we have 16, so we have eight groups. We're gonna make okay. eight groups. Okay, here we go. Okay, get into your groups, please. Correct. Okay? okay, and I start working. I will give you seven minutes, okay? Get into your groups, please. Okay, very good. Blanca, get into group number one. Annie, group number three. Okay, the rest, Madeline, group number six. Veronica, what are you doing alone, Veronica? Okay, so go to group number two, Veronica. Veronica, are you there, Veronica? Okay, very good. You changed the group. <laughs> yeah, I'm here. <laughs> so what is number number three? Oh, you're gonna do number one again? Yeah. Okay, so what is number one? Ah, and you see they change. They change the, the oh, this question. Is, yeah, okay, so it's okay, it's the same thing. Yes. What is wrong? Now it says, what is wrong in this sentence? Uh, make this one, the auxiliary verb components have and been should be, I don't know. To be together? No. The auxiliary, the auxiliary verb should be have. Exactly. Why? Because the ministers. Uh -huh. are yeah, plural. because it's a plural subject, right? Uh, but, so that is. Uh, but, but this, no, not this is correct. Bad. Why has the minister? No, this is correct. Don't worry. This is correct. Okay. This is the correct answer. Let me see. Okay, now go ahead. Despite means a pesar. Okay, despite. Um, despite. Despite means a pesar de. Despite, despite the transgression. His reputation has not been harmed. Okay, very good. Has not been harmed. So check that. Very good. Excellent. Okay, okay, number three. You write this. This is this. Which is correct. Misle Measles. Measles have not been contracted but by them. Excellent. Very good. Very good. Number four. The, res the results of degree examination have not been announced uh, yet. yet. Okay, very, no, uh, uh, yes. uh, the results, yeah, that's correct, the results, very good. Next. Okay. 
Who is next? Blanca or Veronica? Veronica. <coughs> uh, have, uh, have been, uh, have the document been? Have been? Submit. Submitted, submitted already. Submitted, submitted, sorry. Uh, have the documents been submitted already? Very good, number six. Okay, so you are doing great, okay? Doing great. I'm going to go to another group. Okay, okay, bye. 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 The complete sense in present perfect passive voice. The result uh, of the degree examination. Eso sí habla de plural, ¿verdad? Okay, no Spanish, Andrea. Uh, English. Sorry, teacher. Uh -huh. Sorry, teacher. Plural, because we're yes, talking about the result. The result. Provide the sentence in present perfect passive form. Choose from the So you have to change that active voice into passive. So what they, have have they have not contacted me. Uh, missiles are not behind contracted by them. I haven't I haven't said anything about that. What are we using? Remember, it's present perfect, Daniel. No, so sería, mainly has not been contracted be them. Uh huh. So you have to use this one, right? Missiles. Missiles have not. Have not been contracted by them. Okay. Remember, missiles. Okay. Then you use because it's. Ah, wait, wait, wait. Uh, has. Okay, has. go ahead. Yeah, uh -huh. no, no, no. This is okay. Have not been contracted. Uh -huh. Have not one, been contracted. One. Okay, very good. Next. Okay. Has she phoned him? him. Uh, has she phoned him? Present what? perfect passive form. Has, uh, has, has she been uh, iPhone B hit? Uh -huh. The only okay. she? <laughs> the only she. <laughs> Okay, very ah, good. No. So Alvaro is with us. Okay, so give Alvaro the opportunity to. So has she found Alvaro. him? Now, hey. what is this? Is the object? What is the subject for him? Uh, era he. Fun. He right he. So has he? Has ah uh, the he. Has he been him. found? Remember past participle. So has he been found? Because him is the object pronoun for he, for the subject pronoun he. Yes. Okay, very good. Okay. Right. Alvaro, we are doing uh, passive voice exercises. Okay? okay so go ahead and join. Okay. The wrong auditorium had been had been entered by me. What is wrong? What is wrong uh, what, with that sentence? The passive what is the one that is wrong? What is wrong with that sentence? What is not correct? What is not correct? Take a look. The the one that is in between. What the the number seven, right? Yeah, number yes. seven. What is not correct about that sentence? Remember, this is the only sentence, only this. The wrong auditorium have been entered by me. So what <clears throat> is wrong in this sentence? What is wrong in that sentence? We have to use, choose one option from the one that are below. Yeah, no. exactly. Yes. But, but you can see it. You look at the sentence and you can see what is wrong. What is wrong? Okay. I think that is the bird. What is the first? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. It, it is correct. 
It uses the wrong form of the main verb. What is the past participle of enter? The past participle is entered with ed. Exactly. <laughs> okay, so you need the past participle there, entered. Okay, okay. very good. I'm going to go to another group, okay? Thank you. Bye. See, to go to the book again. <laughs> okay. What, what is the problem? Oh, teacher. Hello. Hello. How are we, you today? Oh, fine. <laughs> oh, fine. A, a little lost with the link. <laughs> a little lost. Why? <laughs> because yes. it, we can inside the link, but no, don't see the the same exercise that do. It's the same exercise. The only thing is the the order of the sentences is, is different. Teacher, but it's the but same the exercise, but the order us. of the sentences is different. Teacher? Yes? But look but, that. Ah, <laughs> but, but this is, the, let me see. The, yeah, the go ahead. The, uh, the uh, you yeah. put in the, in the chat? Yeah, but it's, it's the first one. link. The first link. This one? No, this is not the first link. Okay, uh, yeah. bring it up. More, more. No, this is not the first link. Give me a second. Okay, so go to the chat and go to the first link. But in the chat, ah. Huh? This, this one is one of the, the link in the book. This one no, is no, the first one. No, but it's not that one. It's on page. Let me tell you what page is that. Ah, I understand what is the mistake. <laughs> okay, now uh, I'm going <laughs> to... I'm going to share with you like my... Okay, so it's on page 36. Ah. Page 36, and, and that is the first link. Ah, okay. Page 36, okay? Page 36. Page 36, quiz number one. 36? That link. Page 36, link number one. Page 38, uh, we have no. the links of page 38. Ah, uh -huh, I know. Okay, uh -huh. so go to page 36 and go to quiz number one, to that link. Okay. Okay? And let me know when you have it. Okay, give me a second. No problem. I give you two. <laughs> yes, <laughs> because <laughs> I think I need more time. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I'm going to close all these things. I opened three links and nothing. Okay. <laughs> it's not, not, I'm not so. You got it? No. Yes, but I can share. Do you, you can't share? No, I can't share. Okay, but I'm going to stop sharing, okay? Okay. Okay, now, can you share now? Let's see. But why I have the same... Look, I don't know what happened here. You can share. Yes. I'm going to get out. Maybe that's what happens. But no, uh -huh. let's see. I'm uh huh. But it's not. Is this link? No, it's this first. Is the first link. It's the first one. Let me see. Yeah. Let me see. Scroll down. Scroll down. Let me see. No, scroll up. Scroll up. No, I think. Uh huh. I think. Let me see. I think that is the second link. I, I put the okay, first one. Go ahead, one. go ahead, leave this one because we're gonna use it. Now upload the other link. Okay. Uh, upload the other the other link, please. Okay. 
No, maybe this one's this one is. Do you have it now? Yes. Okay, very good. This is ah. the second one. Uh huh. This is the second link. Okay, no, this is the second link. So let's go back to the first link. Is this one? Yeah. Okay, but let's go scroll down. More. That's okay. all, teacher. What happened? I don't know. It, it was the same link that you put in the chat. Yeah, I know. I know. I don't know what happened. Okay. Mm, no, if it, this is the computer of my job. Okay, don't, never mind. Okay, I'm going to bring you out. Okay? okay. And we are going to do the second link. Okay. Okay. Okay, how was the exercise? Easy? Hard. 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 Okay. What I think what we need is to practice. That's all. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's all. Okay, it's a matter of practice. So the more we practice, the better we get. Okay. So okay. don't panic. Okay, now um, let me share <laughs> my screen with you. Okay. So I have okay. that exercise right here. Okay, so we did number one and, and we did number two. Okay, let's do number one again. Okay, it says this, the active voice sentence is, they have not contracted missiles. So what is the passive voice? What is the passive voice? Missiles have, has, has not been. been. Have not been contracted. contracted by them. Exactly. Measles have not been contracted by them. Very good. Correct. <laughs> number two. What is number two? Um, um, have, have, have been submitted. Have been no, submitted. no, no. I want the, the passive voice sentence. I don't want the, the answer. Uh, okay. I want the passive voice have, sentence. Have the documents been submitted already? Uh -huh. Have the documents been submitted already? Very good. Very good. Now, number three. Okay, let's see. Uh, Madeline, what is number three? And the number three is the... Uh, <laughs> okay, wait. It says, wait, what is wrong? What is what wrong? What is wrong? The, the sentence is correct. The, the sentence... The sentence is correct as is. No, the sentence is not correct. Yes, co yes, ah, teacher. The, yes, the, yeah, the, yeah, yeah, it's correct because we're talking about <laughs> yes. the subject yes. is the minister's trip. So the minister trip is singular. So why has the minister trip been postponed? So that is correct. Yes, teacher. Correct. Teacher, okay. what is postponed? What is postponed? Okay, when you leave things for later, that is to postpone. For ah. example, you were supposed to have finished homework section four and you didn't do it. So because you postpone it. No, postpone. I'll do it tomorrow. Is that clear? Ah, okay. Postpone, postpone, so postponer. Ah, okay. Okay, Thank very you. good. Number four. What is number four, uh, Eugenia? Uh, nearly 500 biscuit packets have been distributed. 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 That is correct. Meals, Distributed. 500 Distributed. biscuit packets have been distributed. Distributed. Okay. So that is correct. Very good. Okay. Now let me see who is next. The next one is Andrea. Number five. Has she told him? It's a question. Remember, it's a question. Yes, has, 
Has he been iPhone be here? Okay. No. Three. Now, three. what is the object? The object is him. Number three. So the object is him. What is the object for? What is the subject for that object? He. He. It's a he. Right. So it should be. Has he been Third. found by her? Mm -hmm. And you see that she, that is the subject, now is going to be the object, her. So has he been found by her? Okay, very good. Oscar, number six. Okay. Has the patient's temperature taken? Uh-huh. Has the patient's, repeat after me, temperature. Temperature. Everybody, temperature. Temperature. Uh, the patient. The patient. The patient. Has the patient's temperature taken? Everybody, repeat after me this, this question. Has the patient's temperature taken? Has the, Has the patient's temperature, temperature taken? Temperature. 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 Okay, very good. So has, has the patient... Has the patient's temperature been taken? Been taken. Been taken. Oh, huh? uh, no, has been taken. Sorry. This is the correct one. Temperature. Uh, repeat, singular. Teacher, repeat, repeat temper, temperature. 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 Okay. Number seven. What is wrong with this uh, passive voice sentence? It uses the wrong form of auxiliary verb and main verb. Aha. Uh -huh. So what it should be the correct auxiliary verb? Has. 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 And the main and verb? Enter it. Enter it. Uh -huh. And it should be the yes. past tense of this verb. Yes. Right? Enter. Yes. Enter should enter. be in the past participle. So mm -hmm. enter. He uses enter. the wrong form of the auxiliary verb and main verb. So this is correct. And this yes. one should be has. Has. Right? Because it's a simple has. subject. Okay? Has being Very entered. Good. Yes. Number nine. Anamika. She's Japanese. So don't wear her. <laughs> Anamika. <laughs> Has been invited. Has been invited. Has been invited. Been invited. invited. Okay. invited. Very good. Osman, number nine. Osman? Turn on your microphone. Have not been announced. Announced. Yet. Okay, that's correct. The results of the degree examination have not have been announced. Have not been, been announced. announced. Very good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, Alvaro, number 10. Number 10 is, let's see, despite. Despite. Despite means a pesar de. <laughs> Despite. Despite the transgression, yeah. his reputation has not been. Uh huh. Has not been? Mm -hmm. Has not been what? Harmed. 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 Okay, so despite the transgression, his reputation has not been harmed. What is the meaning of harm? Dañado, dañado. Okay. Dañado. So, I have here, I have here a, a list of verbs, okay? So I can send you this tomorrow, okay? Harmed with D, harmed. 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 And let me see if it is here. Probably it's not here. No, it is not here. Okay? But harm means dañar. So his reputation has not been harmed. Okay? 
a pesar de la transgresión, su reputación no ha sido dañada. ¿Ok? Very good. Now, eh, upload the other link, please. Ok. You have the second link? Upload it, please. Eh, can, ah, ok. Yes, I... Ok, the other one, the second link yes. is easier. Mm -hmm. This is easier. Okay. okay. Now let's see. Uh, Raul, number one. Yes, uh, I have finished the job. The job uh, has been finished. finished. Uh -huh. the finished uh, with T at the end. The, ha the job has been finished. Okay, very good. Uh, next, uh, wait, let me check. Let me check the list first, okay? okay. Yader? Okay. Absent. Lancastella Perez de Vasquez? Present, teacher. Thank you. Maria Eugenia Cruz de Magaña? Present, teacher. Thank you. Bessie Anayensi Jovel Valiente? Present. Thank you. Oscar Eduardo Majano Guevara? Present. Thank you. Eh, Raúl Mauricio Rivas Saldívar? Raúl Mauricio Rivera Saldívar. Sorry. Raúl, Mari, Raúl Mauricio Rivera Saldívar. Okay. Hola, Manuel. Saraí Hernández. Present. Ok. Eh, Marta Beatriz Alegría Barahona. Present. Thank you. Álvaro Enrique Rivas Ángel. Present teacher. Thank you. Rafael René Molina Ventura. Present, sir. Thank you. María Adelina okay. Raya Menéndez. Present teacher. Thank you. Alicia Carolina López Núñez. Present teacher. Thank you. Osman Enrique Hernández. Present teacher. Present, present, remember. Present. present. Hey, hey, hey. Good job, man. Okay. I forgot. I forgot. Fuentes. <laughs> Daniel Osvaldo Pérez Aguilar. Present teacher. Okay. Verónica Beatriz Mendoza Álvarez. Present teacher. Thank you. Ana del Carmen Cortés de Núñez. Present teacher. Thank you. Andrea Alexandra Flores Chacón. Present teacher. Thank you. Kenia Johanna Pérez Pérez. Vanessa Alexandra Arma Rosales. Okay, guys. Now, look. I want you. Okay, we are going. Before we work with the with this uh, a quiz, passive voice, present perfect quiz, I want you to do the, the survey. Okay? So I'm going to show you. Okay, let me show you. Let me see. Okay, got it right here. Okay, so take a look. Okay, I want you to go to this link. Okay, but fíjese bien. Esto lo voy a decir en español porque es bien delicado. Okay, los que ya mandaron la encuesta no la van a hacer. Porque la encuesta okay. solo se puede mandar una sola vez. Los que no han mandado la encuesta, por favor, peguen este link. Denle clic a este link para entrar a la encuesta. ¿Ok? Los que no han hecho la encuesta, denle clic a este link, por favor. Y me avisan. ¿Ya? Sí. Sí. I'm sorry. 
I did in the morning, but I forget to take the picture. But I okay. did. Pero ahí tiene la tiene la 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 la, la encuesta. Yeah. Va, entonces tómele foto y mándela. La tiene que mandar a este número en el WhatsApp o a este correo. ¿Ok? okay. Entonces Teacher, vaya a la encuesta question. y vea que ya la tenga terminada y, y tome la foto. Teacher, I got a question. Yes. When is the last time we can send that picture? Tonight. Tonight. Hoy. Really? Sí, así que dele click a esa, a esa, a ese link. Okay. Dele click y vaya a la encuesta. Ángel. Ventura. Hola, hola. <risa> ya. Vaya. Ya, ya todos están en encuesta. Los que no la han hecho. Vaya, yo le voy a recomendar, usted tiene, va, lo más importante es esto. El orden de inicio, usted le va a dar, le va a hacer esto, de copy, paste. Copy and paste. De aquí, del, de, esta información usted ya la tiene. Se la mandaron a su correo, creo, o al, o al WhatsApp. Entonces, vaya allí y agarre esa información. Y la pega en encuesta. ¿Está claro? Hola, no oigo, no lo escucho. Yes, teacher. Sí, vaya. Yes, teacher. Vaya. Entonces, la siguiente es nombre del proveedor con el que se capacitó. Entonces usted va a poner todo esto. Inglés corporativo. Regal International SADCB. Todo eso okay. lo va a copiar y lo va a pegar ahí en la información de su encuesta. ¿Ya? Yes. Vaya, donde dice nombre del curso, exactamente como está aquí, inglés intermedio módulo 2. So you copy and paste. Y los datos de su nombre tienen que ir así como están en su inscripción. Su número de celular y su, su correo y su número de celular y nombre de la empresa de la tal cual como Insafor los tiene registrados. Sí, su nombre, su correo, su número de celular y el nombre de su empresa, tal como Insafor los tiene registrados. Luego, no sé si ya, ya hizo esa parte. Su nombre, su correo, su número de celular y el nombre de su empresa. Así como los registró, se registraron con Insafor. ¿Ya tiene eso? No lo escucho. Dígame si ¿sí? ya lo tenemos o no. Todavía estoy trabajando en eso. Working. Ajá, ok, perfecto, excelente. Ni eso es muy teacher. ¿Perdón? Diga. Ajá, tú. Número tú. Number, no, number complete. Ajá, eh, así como usted está registrado. Put, y, y, su nombre completo, nombre su completo. correo oh, que usted okay. proveyó a Recursos Humanos y el número de celular okay. que usted le proveyó a, a, a Recursos Humanos para que lo inscribieran. Y el nombre de la empresa tal como se inscribió en Insafor. Okay. 
¿Ya? ¿Cómo vamos hasta ahí? ¿Cómo vamos hasta ahí? ¿Ya podemos correr? Vale, la siguiente es ¿En qué fecha inició el curso? Aquí está la fecha, cópiela y péguela. ¿En qué fecha finalizó el curso que es hoy? Cópiela y péguela, tal como está ahí. Ya hizo ese paso. Así como está pegada, en la, así como le aparece en la información. Y luego, yo solo les voy a leer las preguntas, no las contesten todavía. Yo les voy a dar un ratito y yo me voy a hacer el loco, ¿ok? Ingrese el número completo de la orden de inicio con guiones y plecas. Será proporcionado por el proveedor. Puede copiar y pegarlo, ¿ok? Ingrese el número completo de la orden de inicio. ¿Se acuerda? Ahí ya la pegó a nombre completo. Ya la pegó. ¿Sí? Aquí está. ¿ve? Orden de inicio. Ese es el número que usted tiene que pegar aquí. Nombre completo, correo electrónico, número de celular, sexo. No se va a equivocar ahí. Empresa donde trabaja. Nombre del proveedor con el que se capacitó. Y tiene que ser inglés corporativo. Regal International. ¿Lo ve? Uy. Sí. Ok. Vaya, ok. Yes. Excelente. Can see. Nombre del curso. Así como aparece aquí, ¿verdad? Inglés Intermedio Módulo 2. Inglés Intermedio Módulo 2. ¿Sí? Vale, ahora dice, valore los siguientes aspectos Bien. relativos al curso. Y dice, ¿cómo considera el tiempo empleado para desarrollar al curso? ¿Insuficiente? ¿Deficiente? ¿Aceptable, bueno o excelente? Usted escoja. ¿Qué opina del contenido y estructura del curso? ¿Insuficiente, deficiente, aceptable, bueno o excelente? ¿Qué opina de las opciones y her herramientas tecnológicas utilizadas en el curso? Y usted ahí opina. Teacher, una pregunta. Diga. No hay, pre, no hay algo ahí que diga sobre el docente. Todo es eh, sobre el curso, pero nada, no habla nada. Ahí de... solamente eso. ¿A qué opina de las opciones y herramientas tecnológicas utilizadas en el curso? Cada uno tenemos diferentes herramientas. ¿Verdad? Entonces, ahí opina usted qué tal le pareció, ¿verdad? Ya, ya, ¿En qué ya, fecha ya. inició el curso? Ahí vamos a poner esta fecha. ¿En qué fecha inició el curso? 27 de agosto. Así como está aquí, de copy and paste. ¿En qué fecha finalizó el curso? También, solo le de julio, copy y paste. ¿Está claro? En julio comenzamos. ¿Cuándo comenzamos? Aquí está, de 27, así, de copy paste. 27 de julio. Pero lo va a poner exactamente como okay. está ahí, ve. No. ¿Está viendo, mi pizarra? ¿Está viendo mi pantalla? No. Tiene yes. que poner, 20, así como está ahí, 27 del 7 del 2020. Así como está ahí, copy-paste. Okay. Vale. ¿Y cuando termina? Yes. Igual, copy-paste. 04 del 09 del 2020. ¿Ok? Ok. okay. Okay. En qué, eh, va, aquí dice cuál es su nivel de satisfacción después de completar el curso. ¿Satisfecho o insatisfecho? Usted lo pone ahí. Mencione que otros cursos son de su interés. Aquí usted puede poner eh, si quiere electricidad o computación o fontanería. Japonés. Ahí puede poner cuál es de su interés. 
Y aquí en los comentarios usted puede poner cualquier tipo de comentario, ya sea de inglés corporativo, del curso, del docente, del grupo, cualquier tipo de comentario. ¿Ok? Luego le da a enviar y al dar, y ya cuando le dio a enviar, usted va a hacer captura de pantalla, así como dice aquí, ¿verdad? Solicitamos favor, al terminar de llenar la encuesta, nos envíe una captura de pantalla de que, de que completó la misma a este número o al grupo de WhatsApp y le pone nombre. Póngale nombre a esa captura para que ellos sepan de quién es. ¿Me explico? Hola. Hola. ¿Cómo fue, teacher? Yes, teacher. Vaya, cuando ¿Cómo usted fue, termina, ¿cómo fue? aquí dice, solicitamos de favor al terminar de llenar la encuesta, nos envíe una captura de pantalla de que completó la misma. Una vez que le envió, ¿verdad? Al, a este número... Ahí puede mandar la, la, la captura de pantalla o al grupo de WhatsApp de nosotros y colocar okay. su nombre completo al enviarla. ¿Estamos de acuerdo? De acuerdo. Ok. Ok. Yes. Y la envían. O, por otro lado, puede mandarla a este correo. Gabriela at inglescorporativo.net como usted quiera Question, preguntas no ok ya terminamos no. todavía no ¿Hay alguien que no haya, no haya hecho la encuesta? ¿Todos lo hicieron? En fin. Lo hicieron antes y lo, yes, que, yes, lo, yes. Lo, que, lo acaban de terminar ahorita, ¿sí? Yes, I do. Ah, yes, I did. I did, sorry. Ok. Vale. Voy a, voy a pasar lista en eso también. Vamos a ver. Blanca, ya la mandó. Sí, teacher, ya la envié. Okay. María Eugenia, did you send it? Yeah, I sent it teacher in this moment in your WhatsApp. Okay, and did you take a picture, right? And put yeah. your, name, no. your name. Okay. Eh, Bessie Anayensi. Ya la envié, teacher. Okay, Oscar Eduardo Majano. Yes, I did it. Okay, Raúl Mauricio Rivera. Yes, I did it. Okay, Nini Besaraí Hernández. Yes, I did. Ok, Marta Beatriz no. Alegría Barahona. Sí, ya le envié. Ok, very good. Ok, uh, Alicia, Car ah, María, Rafael, René Molina. Rafael. Rafael René Molina. Rafael, ya envió la, ya envió la, la encuesta. Rafael, Álvaro Enríquez, Álvaro Enrique Rivas. No yet, teacher. I got some problems uh, with writing the date. The date, but. Bien. Tiene que mandarlo a SIVA 27, clica 07, clica 2020. Es mejor que la pegue. Ajá. Es mejor que la pegue, así no va a tener problema, Álvaro. Váyase pegué. donde le mandaron la información y cópiela y péguela. Es más fácil. Ok, Chicho. Ok, vamos a ver. Rafael René Molina. Present, sir. ¿Ya, ya, ¿Ya envió la encuesta, Rafael? Sí, eh, ayer ah, la vale. hice. María Adelina. Sleeping, María Adelina. Alicia Carolina. Yes, I did. 
Ok, Osmín Enrique, Osmán Enrique Hernández. Hey, don't say my name. Ay, ay, sorry, I'm sorry. Sen. Sen. Uh, okay, remember when you didn't write your name on the list. Okay, Daniel Osvaldo yes. Pérez. Ayer la envié. Okay, Verónica Beatriz Mendoza. Teacher, yeah, I did, but uh, uh, the picture uh, I can send in the group. Yeah, you can send it to the group or you can send it to this number. No, okay, group, group is okay. Thank to you. To the group is okay. To the group is okay. Ana del Carmen Cortez de Núñez. Present teacher. Ya, ya envió su encuesta. Yes. Ok. Yesterday. Andrea Alexandra. Andrea. Ya se fue a dormir, Andrea. <laughs> ok, very good. Now, let's go to teacher. the exercise. Teacher, okay. I sent it. Ah, you already sent it. Ok, very good. Very good. Excellent. And did you take a picture? You you make a, a screenshot and send it, right? With your name under it. Okay. Uh, has everybody finished? Alvaro? Not yet. Now I'm just sending it. Okay, very good. I'll give you one more minute. And another thing that I want to remind you is to finish homework number four. That is the homework for all section four. So that is 4.1, 4.3, 4.5, 4.7, and 4.9. Please finish it and send in the final, okay, before noon. Before noon, because el, el, the coordinator is expecting that I send everything at, at noon. So I need you to send it before noon so I can put it on the grade sheet. Okay? Okay, teacher. And send it to her at noon. I would like okay. to send it before, but you have to help when? me. Okay? When is the last day? Tomorrow? Is, yeah, tomorrow. well, tomorrow before noon. Tomorrow at 11. Okay, if you send it at 11, that gives that give me a chance to pick up the grades and put it in the correct uh, grade sheet to send it to her. Okay? So, did you finish, Alvaro? Yes, I finished. Okay, okay, everybody finished. So, we are going to do the second link. Now, for the second link, I'm going to break you in groups so you can work on it. Are you ready? Are you ready, Bessie? Do you have the right link? <laughs> yes, I have the right link. <laughs> okay, here we go. I will uh, break you into groups, okay? So let me see how many are we? We are 16, okay, so here we go. Get into your group and start working on that new link. Start working on that new link.
Ajá, uh -huh, Andrea, what happened, Andrea? Teacher. Hello. I'm my way just to ask you what the link is, what link we have to do use. Okay. Uh, do you have the book? It's in yeah, the chat. Yeah. In the chat, I sent two links. Look yeah, in the chat. It's it the second link. It's the second link. Yeah. I ask you is if the present perfect tense. Let me see, let me go check my... Because I just I just have two links in the second, say something about voice exercise, present perfect tense. Let me check. Let me check what it says. It says... It says... Passive voice exercise, present perfect tense. Yes, that, that's uh -huh. that. And the number one that. is, I have finished the job. Do you have that one? Yeah, I got that. Okay, so that is the one. So go ahead, do number one. I have finished the job. The job. So what is the passive voice? The job has been finished by me. Excellent, very good. Check. Number two, uh, who was that? Blanca, Blanca. or Henry? Blanca. <laughs> okay, Eugenia, don't do number two. Yeah, the cat has drawn the milk. The milk has been drawn by the, by the Excellent. cat. Excellent. Blanca, number three. The gear has looked at the Plucked. flower. Plucked. 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 The girl has plucked the flowers. The flower has the flower have been plucked by her. No, no plucked, plucked. Plucked. Ah, pronunci <laughs> the pronunciation <laughs> is T, T at the end. Plucked. Plucked. Uh -huh. Plucked. 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 So yeah, the, the flowers have been plucked by her. Very good. Number four. Who is next? Blanky, because I make two. <laughs> okay, I, go ahead. I have watched that movie. Again, that no movie. watch it. Watch. 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 With T at the end. Okay. Watch. I have watched that movie. That movie has been. Have been or has, has been. been? Has been watched by no, me. No watch it. Watch. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, teacher. It's okay, no problem. I has been watched by me. Okay, excellent. The next one, Eugenia. Peter has broken another window. Another window has been broken by Peter. Excellent. Number six. Uh, hey, you are doing great. I'm gonna go to another group. Okay, thank you. You don't need you don't need my help. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> this is the puff girls <laughs> yeah oh. very good very good <laughs> no i was i was thinking in the second oh uh-huh what is the problem here? have this you received the parcel yeah so has what is correct we, we were thinking uh-huh. What is number seven? Has the parcel been received? Received. 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 Received the, the, with B at the end. Received. The received. By you. Received. Has by the you. parcel been received by you? Excellent. Has the parcel been received by you? 
By you. Okay, what is number eight? By you. Number we, eight. We did all, teacher. Uh huh. We, we finished. Finish. Very, very simple, right? Very, very simple, very easy. That, that was good. That was good, okay? Yeah. So good. Hey, like I said, it's a matter of practice. The more you practice, the better you get, okay? Yeah. So you can go. Yes. You can go in, for example, I'm going to show you, okay? Let me bring everybody in, okay? I think right. everybody has finished. <laughs> Hello, everybody. How was the practice? It's was fine. It's easy. It's, it's easy, easy, right? Easy. This was it's easier. Easy. Okay, easier than the other one. Okay, very good. Uh huh. Okay, let me see, three, 11. Okay, very good. Okay, remember that uh, Eugenia is going to stay with me after 10, okay? Who? Me? <laughs> I think but, it's Eugenia, right? No, yesterday was my, my uh, No, today is Beatriz. Yeah, today is Beatriz. So Beatrice is gonna stay. It's gonna stay with me. Okay, very good. So we finished so far. Okay, very good. Okay, now we're gonna go. Now the next part is let's continue with the book. Okay, let me see if I can find the book. I cannot find the book. So hold on. Uh huh. The book is right here. Okay, now. Climbed. Climb. What? Climb. I I read it. <laughs> I read it. <laughs> okay, so now that we are we are clear with the with the present perfect. Now, what about the effects and risks of risks and hazards on the business operation? Okay, now remember we went through this. What are casualties? What is property damage? What is loss of customers? We did it, teacher, we did it. Yeah, I know, we did it. Okay, I'm just reviewing <laughs> that, okay? Now, and we discussed this, okay? We gave our opinion what what we think is the most serious, okay, uh, impact in the for the business financial uh, casualties trust in the organization. So we did that too. Casualties, casual is the is 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 the. Uh, it's good the pronunciation, casualties. Casual, no, casualties. 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 Schwa, schwa, casualties. 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 Okay. Now, we are going to do this activity. Okay? I want you to go to the internet and you look for a... Uh, a national or international case of business organization affected by risks or hazards that were not controlled effectively. Is that clear? Do you remember record, Bateria record here in El Salvador? Yes. Okay, so that was a national case of not having, you know, of being, not being prepared and they, uh, there were a lot of people that were killed, a lot of casualties, okay? And pro, uh, that was a business interruption, loss of customers, loss of trust in the organization. Is that clear? And obviously, financial loss. So I'm going to break you into groups, and you go to the internet, and you find one of those organizations, find out the hazard or risk that caused the business to get in and uncontrollable situation. 
list the business consequences caused by the hazard or the risk that went beyond control. Okay? And then you will present it to the class. Is that clear? What okay. you find in the internet in groups, you are going to present it to the class. Okay? I will give you 20 minutes. Okay. Okay, everybody repeat, see what repeat. you have to do? Repeat. And you can prepare it with a yes. PowerPoint presentation, no problem, okay, if you want. So I'm going to break you into groups. I'm going to make five groups, okay, so you can work in trios. Are you ready? You have to prepare in this group a document in PowerPoint or something like that. Yeah, if you want, or just, you know, write it, write it on Word. What we want is to talk, to find out the information, to discuss it. And then uh, tell us what happened. At the end, what I want you is that you talk. Is that clear? Yeah, it's clear. So if you want to prepare a, a, a PowerPoint presentation, fine with me, no problem. All right? So here we go. All right. In the case that you don't have a computer with you, don't do it. Just, just tell me what happened, okay? But answer this question. Find out the hazard or the risk that caused the business to get in an uncontrollable situation and list all the business consequences caused by that hazard. Okay, that's all. Are you ready? Here yeah. we go. Okay, so you will have 20 minutes. Okay, let me recreate now five groups. Here we go. Okay, go ahead. Get into your groups, please. Madeline, get in, please. Group number five.
Washington, Chernobyl. Nínive, Nínive will talk. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Do you need more time? Do you need five more minutes? You see, yeah, all that there. is important. All that is important. All that. Okay, so some of you is going to say something, some of you more, and some of you the end. Okay? So I give you what? Five more minutes? Six more minutes. I'm going to give you six more minutes. Okay? Okay. All right. Okay, okay. very good. Good work. Okay. <laughs> hey. Y bien que nos dicen la pizza, eh, lo que están viendo cuatro o cinco causas. Creo que está bastante. No Spanish. <laughs> What are you talking about? No Spanish, please. <laughs> okay, okay. No Spanish. okay, so do you need more time? Like six minutes? Yes. Six <laughs> Remember, some of you is going to talk about some information. So, you know, the other one, yeah. more information, and the last one is going to yeah. close. The only man in this group. Huh? <laughs> Nothing. So, everybody, so everybody has to say something. Okay, so you divide. Okay, you're going to say this, you're going to say this, and you're going to say that. Right? Okay. Okay, very good. Okay. Great, great. I'm going to go to another group. Okay. Well, uh, this lesson, I... Dice, pero es muy corta la información. In English, in English. Sorry, teacher, sorry. Catch you. Catch you. I don't know, say... Um... <laughs> I caught you right on the <laughs> act. <laughs> okay, so yes. you're talking about the what happened at the three towers. Yes. Yes. Okay, yes. but but remember that that must be in English. Okay. okay. So you have to prepare the information in English. Yes. Because you are going to tell me yes. what happened in English. Now, remember, yeah. one of you is going to say part of the information, another one, another part of the information, and the last one, the last part. Okay, you have five more minutes. Five more minutes to prepare. Oh my God. Okay, teacher. Okay, okay very good, very good. I don't like the teacher said. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. Ah. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm right here. Hey, yes. Why is I, the group only two members? Who who is the other member? I don't know. I you think know. Alvaro Alvaro told us about he have an issue with with his internet. Ah. Okay. Okay. So. Have you finished? Okay. Are you, are you yes. ready for your presentation? Yes. 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 Just okay. So prepare. You have five more minutes. So prepare. What okay. are you going to say? Divide. Divide the information. You are going to say this. You are going to say this. Is that clear? Okay. Okay. Very okay. good. Yeah, okay. He is uh, for September <laughs> for first 2020. The comma. Okay. You need a comma after fourth. Now. No, after fourth. After no, no, on, on the fourth. Before. No. Before four? No, after, after fourth. After four? No, after TH. Yeah, after ah, TH. After TH. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay, yes. now listen, guys. Okay, di divide, divide the information that each one of you is going to say. Okay? Okay, okay. So, so you are going to say this, you are going to say this, and you are going to say this. 
So you have three more minutes to do that, okay? And then I will bring you so everybody starts presenting, okay? Okay. Okay, very good. Hola, 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 hola. Hi, Marie. In English, in English. Oh, uh oh. Ang angry husband. We finished. <laughs> no. Okay, so you have three more minutes. You have three no, more my minutes. No, my, my, my co workers. Ah, okay. Okay, so you have three my more minutes. My co workers. Remember. Remember, I, don't read. I, I, don't, wait a minute, wait a minute. Don't read, ah. okay? So you have to study your vocabulary. Your, okay. your, you have to study what you, the information that you are going to say, okay? I finished, we, we finished the, the, the document. Yeah, the document, but now you are going to present it. I don't want you to read, I want you to tell me. Now, everybody, Oh, in your group has to talk, so you divide the information. Right. Madeline is going to say this, Raul is going to say this, Annie is going to say this. Is that clear? Okay, so you have two more minutes, two more minutes. So okay. divide the information, please. Teacher, a few time. Hello, I need, Hello, I teacher. need more time. You need more time. No, yes, we teacher. only have nine minutes, <laughs> and everybody has to present. So get okay. ready. Remember, we first, we first I don't want anything professional, you know. Just tell me what happened, what you what you read, okay, what you prepare. All right. Okay. Okay, everyone, who's going to be the first? We, Alicia and I, Eugenia. Okay, Please. Alicia and Eugenia, okay, tell us. Okay, Alicia, we, will, we will share the screen with our presentation. Okay, very good. Okay, uh, we will talk about uh, of this case in, in El Salvador. Uh, it's about the record batteries uh, company and mm -hmm. it was about one of the biggest environmental disasters in El Salvador. The, mo the, main, the main cause uh, of the contamin contamination is that the batteries, uh, a battery recycling plant in which it uses highly toxic raw materials polluting the environment and harmful to human health uh, because these batteries uh, contained lead and the lead is dangerous for for the human because the lead is uh, a toxic material in the blood and uh, Eugenia will be will will tell about uh, the consequence. Okay, very well. Good, and applause, yeah. Blanca. Good, yeah. okay, Blanca. Okay, uh, Maria Eugenia. Applause. Okay. The consequence of this contamination in this company, 369 former workers of the battery factory were detected lead about 70 because microgram, but the damage was not only in the employees. According to the Environmental Committee of the place, 
who put in alert the authorities denouncing that approximately 700, I think. 7,000. 7,000, 7,000, 250. 250. 50 people who live in six neighboring communities have been affected by the pollution generated by the factory. And uh, the cost of environmental damage yeah. is estimated an amount for a billion dollars. Okay. This factory don't uh, affect the employees and the people living nearly the factory causing many disease uh, and in the in the people and uh, someone of them ending with the death and loss for the their families and affect the, the environment and, and causing the loss of their how do you say be I think it's living well, teacher. What? The, what, what do you this, want to say? This company eh, acerca que afecta su modo de vida. Affected their uh, their way of living. Ah, affecting their well living. Their the, way of living, okay. The oh. Way of living oh. of these people. Just that. Okay, very good. Okay. Excellent. Okay, very good. Very good. <laughs> Okay, okay, now who's going to be next? Bravo, Alicia. Thank you. Okay. Okay, who's going to be welcome. next? Madeline, if you insist. No. <laughs> yeah, come on. Quickly. Go ahead, present, present, please. We have the document, teacher. It's okay. If you don't have the document, it's okay. You can talk. What we want, remember, the document is not important. What is important is talking. That's what is important. Okay, go ahead, present it. Um, I remember that we talked about the consequence of oh the consequence of risk and hazard me uh -huh. madeline your microphone <laughs> your microphone is off my madeline turn it on and we work with Rafa. Uh -huh, Rafa. So who's going to... Oh, no, 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 it's Rafa. Okay. <laughs> our, our document is about the consequence and effects of risks and hazards in the companies. Rather than discuss the benefits of risk management in the article, I want to take some time to explain what can possibly... Possible, uh, possible happen. Possibly, possibly. Possibly happen if you do not proactively identify assets and manage risks in your organization. Uh, as explained, LC risks in their context is more than just potential hazard. It includes any threat. Any threat. Threat. Uh, threat. Threat or opportunity to achieve business or objectives. Um, okay. Wait. I'm Blanca, okay. Okay, who uh, is the next, who is the next uh, member of your, of your group? Uh, my is Ana, Ana del Carmen Cortez de Nunez uh, um, presents eight, eight uh, effects. A effects uh, in the company uh, when when I when we have hazards. Okay. Uh, okay, Ana del Carmen, read it, please. <laughs> and fines and, and I okay. 
one finds. Read it, please. <laughs> Ana. Mauricio. Ah, Raúl. Raúl Mauricio. Raúl, are you there? Um, Go ahead, yeah. Raúl. Uh, sorry, but we doesn't have time to read it. No, you just tell me. Just tell me what what you what you discuss with your group. That's all. What you remember. Remember, it's not a very formal presentation. It's just telling what happened. Uh, was um, a risk for well, sorry, I'm going to. We find a, a document they have for, a for a risk and the hazards uh, who has the, the risk in the, in the companies. Uh, so they should, they have, I think, three uh, type of, of risks. It, and, and it's fine, fines. The other was, uh, I don't remember, employee turn, turnover. And the last one, I don't, don't remember now. Okay, very good. Very Customer good. dissatisfactions. Okay, very good. Turnovers. Okay. Ali, Okay, now, uh, an agency, uh, let me see, Bessie, an agency, do you have your presentation with your group? Hello, teacher, uh, Beatriz is going, is, is helping us with the presentation. Ah, okay. Teacher, I shared my screen now. So, there is a presentation. I can share okay, my screen. It's, it's, uh, uh, Merlin, stop sharing. Hmm. Okay, wait. Stop sharing. <laughs> okay, very good. So go ahead, uh, Betsy. But we we have a, or three of us are going to. Uh huh. Well, Chernobyl accident in 1986. Very good. And yes, uh, we talked about the, the Chernobyl accident in 19, 1986 that I know it's a very big accident in World War about the environment and is that, uh, well, the Chernobyl accident in 1986 was the result of the flow, flow wind reactor design that was operate with uh, inadequately trained personnel. So, and the resulting steam explosion and fires released, at least 5% of the radioactive reactor core into the environment with the, the, posi the position of radi radioactive materials in many parts of Europe. Uh -huh. Who is next? Osman. Osman. Okay. Uh, I'm going to talk a, 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 a little about the Chernobyl accident. Also, uh, the news uh, says two Chernobyl plants workers died uh, due, due to the explosion on the, on the night of the accident in a future in the future future 28 people dying within a few weeks as a result of acute acute radiation syndrome i i understand after the the accident many people die in this case uh, say around 28, 28 people uh, also uh, the people uh, run with uh, the four body, the, uh, the four in the body. Uh, I don't know if it's only that. 
Okay, that's good. Next. Teacher. Yes. Uh, our group with with the uh, Oscar and Ninive, we were we're going to talk about the uh, Chernobyl too. Ah, okay. Hey, go ahead. people, what's Come up? On, <laughs> okay, go ahead. Talk about Chernobyl. <laughs> yes. It's good, uh, that's me. Go ahead. We have a. Uh, we were read, reading about what happened in Chernobyl. And we found the information uh, like uh, or uh, uh, classmates say, in Chernobyl, the reactor killed 30 operators and firemen within three months and several further deaths later. This is important because uh, this is not a an accident that stopped right, right in the moment. The people is still dying after the accident. Some people die next day. Other people die next week and next month. It's, it's, it's like that. And other people, the documents say, they die next year. The, a year and later. A year later. A week later, a month later, a year later. Yes. And some people get just uh, affected for the radiation. Okay. And Nineveh Nini is going to talk more. Okay. Nineve, okay. I know you're there. <laughs> yes, I am there. <laughs> Okay, um, and this accident, like the other group said, was in 1986. So it's so sad that this accident uh, have around 34 years ago, and the radiation continues in this place. Um, was a result a big mistake, or? Oh. Like uh, <laughs> we we said in a several big regatta. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was a big mistake, right? <laughs> a big mistake. <laughs> okay. Um, only that. <laughs> okay, very good. Now, do we have a group that haven't presented? Okay, guys, thank you very much for your time. Thank you for these five weeks that we have spent together. I don't know if we're going to be together in the next intermediate three, but I want to wish you the best. I want you that you, you are a great group, okay? And go ahead, do what you're doing. Thanks, you Talking, uh, going to the, to the video conferences, and practice English. That's all, okay? It was a pleasure for me with, to be with you, okay? So thank you very much. You. And probably, I probably, we are thank you for all. Teacher, I wish teacher. you all the best. You're a good teacher. Yes, thank you, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Thank you for all. Thank you for helping us. Okay, you're welcome. Okay. Thank you, thank you very much. If you need anything from me, just give me a call. You got my phone number? Give me a call, okay? Okay, thank you, teacher. I will be glad to help you. Bye. And Alicia. A Daniel, Beatriz, Bessie, bye. Bye. <laughs> Happy birthday, bye, everyone. Remember okay. me on ten, September 10th, please. Yes, I will okay. do it. It's my birthday. Send you, uh, it's my birthday. I will it's send you a greeting, okay? <laughs> yes, don't remember. Don't, don't okay. forget it. Don't forget it. Okay. No, I won't. Have a nice okay, night. Okay, Rest. Good yes, night. My birthday. Okay, okay bye. very good. Okay. The teacher no one say message at your at your Ma phone. Madeline, I need I need to talk to Beatriz. 
so you have to end your session. Okay, and Annie too. Okay, thank you, Annie. Okay, Beatriz, what do you want me? How can I help you tonight? What do you think are your weaknesses in this course um, or in English? I think that, well, I need more vocabulary in general. <laughs> uh, more vocabulary? Yes. Okay. And for the pronunciation of some words. And the pronunciation, okay. So what you need is to listen more English. Yeah. Okay. So uh, if you listen to music, try that that music is in English. Not Los okay. Tigres del Norte, no, <laughs> nothing like that. You know, music in English. So you can start hearing pronunciation, okay? And start okay. also a... Uh, reproducing what they said. The other okay. one is uh, watch movies in English. Okay. Yes, that yes, I I watch the movies in English always. And I try to. Okay, and try like Netflix. I don't know if you have Netflix. Yes, if my series are in English. <laughs> okay, and put the subtitles in English too. Oh, okay. okay, subtitles in English so you can see and hear what they are saying. And okay. whenever you see a new word, stop, stop the, the, the recording and you reproduce the same sound, right? So that okay. is a good way to memorize things, okay? And for mm -hmm. example, you hear something new, stop it, okay? And, and search there. And search, yeah. You need a, a good dictionary too, okay? So you can search for the words, okay? Now remember, in English, there are many uh, two-word verbs, okay, or phrasal verbs, okay? And you need to get acquainted with those phrasal verbs. Also, there are many slangs, okay? Uh, those are phrases that uh, grammatically, they don't make sense, but okay. in the English culture, they do make sense. Do you understand? Yes. Yes. So we need to get onto that. So that's what you need. And uh, on top of that, you need friends that speak English. Yes, I have a lot of friends. Well, in my work, I need to speak uh, English, and. Also, I practice, well, I improve my English with my friends and, and how do you say, compañero de trabajo? And my room, and my workmates. Workmates. So uh -huh. Or my co-workers. Also, my co-workers. Is very now, nice. listen, okay, one advice. You have to think this way. Who is the one who needs to practice, them or you? I you right so you speak to them in english if they answer back in spanish even though they speak english you keep talking in english don't don't think that because they don't want to speak english with you you have to speak spanish to them no okay. you just think i am the one who needs to be producing or speaking in english so i'm going to when I see somebody that speaks English, I'm going to speak English with them. And don't okay. worry if you make mistakes. That is part, that is part of the method. That is part of the process, making mistakes. Now, yes, we make course. mistakes when, we now, are. if we don't, if we don't talk, we never gonna know where we make mistakes. So yes, the first thing is, go ahead, talk, as much as you can. When you make a mistake, you look at your mistake, you try to fix it, and then, you know, and you will see, like for example, in these five weeks that you have been practicing with us, I can tell how all of you came, and you were a little rusty, all of you, not only you, all of you were a little rusty talking. And mm -hmm. after these five weeks, you are 
loosen up, okay? So that's what you have to do, okay? Now, probably you have a lot of vocabulary, Beatriz, and you have to use it, talking. Okay. Because it's right there in your memory, but if you don't use it, you're gonna forget it. You understand? Okay. Yes, of course, teacher. Okay, uh, what else can we talk about? What else uh, do you think you need? Okay, like for example, you can call me sometimes and let's speak in English. All right, no okay. problem. Consider me a friend now, a friend that speaks English. So you can call me and say, hey, hi teacher, how are you? Do you have a couple minutes and let's talk? No problem. Okay. Okay, so and do that with everybody that you know. With everybody that you know that is speak English. Speak to them in English. You have to be clear. The one that needs the practice is me. So I'm going to talk to English speakers. It doesn't matter if we can communicate in Spanish. Only if it's very important what you have to say, then you say it in Spanish, but otherwise in English. Okay? Okay. Yes, that's good because I need to improve that and it's for that reason that I stay, I take this course because I want to improve my English and uh, be better for my pronunciation and some like that. I need to practice my listening, my pronunciations and some vocabulary too. So yeah, I work in that. <laughs> yeah, and you remember listening besides the people that you talk to, uh, music in English and uh, movies with English subtitles, okay? And you okay. will see, I have a friend, I have a friend, he learned English by watching DVD movies, DVD movies in English with English subtitles, and he learned, okay? So. Yes. That depends how much time do we put into practicing. The more okay. time that we practice, the better and the more fluent that we are going to get. Okay? That's right. Okay, so I wish you the best. Go to sleep. Uh, remember to finish your task number four, homework number four, and the final and test the final. before noon. Okay? Okay. Okay, Thank very you, good. Teacher. Have a good night then. Okay, night. and I hope to Listen. see you soon. Okay? Yes, of course. <laughs> Maybe. Good night. Good night.